Stories with Sandy with Calvert Library and welcome to Bedtime Stories. This evening I'd like to read you a story about our friend Bear. There's lots of stories about Bear, but in this one, Bear feels scared. You know, sometimes we all feel a little bit scared, but we find that we'll all be okay with the help of our friends. So let's read Bear Feels Scared, written by Karma Wilson and illustrated by Jane Chapman. We'd like to say a special thank you to the publisher, Simon & Schuster, for allowing us to share this with you today. In the deep dark wood, by a strawberry veil, a big bear lumbers down a small crooked trail. Bear's tummy growls as he looks for a snack, but it's cold, 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 so the bear turns back. But he's not yet at home when the sun starts to set, and the bear feels scared. Bear shakes and he shivers as the storm starts to howl. Bear mutters, oh, what is that? Are there spooks on the prowl? The path gets dimmer and the sky grows gray. The bear looks to and fro, but he can't find his way. He huddles by a tree and he wails, poor me. And the bear feels scared. Meanwhile, back in the warm, cozy lair, friends start to worry about their poor lost bear. It's late, now squeaks, and our bear doesn't roam. There's a storm, cries Hare. Shouldn't bear be at home? Wren tweets from his perch. We must all go and search. What if bear feels scared? The friends bundle up and begin to prepare. They form a search party for their lost friend, Bear. But Bear is all alone and he sheds big tears. There's a noise in the forest and he feels big fears. Bear trembles in the wind, how he longs for a friend. And Bear feels scared. Badger lights a lamp. And he shouts, let's go. All the birds search high, all the rest search low. With a flounce and a flutter, they set off together. They trudge down the trail through the wild, wet weather. They call, oh bear, are you there? Are you there? And the bear feels scared. But he perks up his ears. <gasps> Is Mole calling out? Is that Hare's voice? <gasps> Does Bear hear him shout? Wren, Owl, and Raven all squawk from the sky. <gasps> it is Bear! He is Bear! And they sigh, big sighs. By a tree waits Bear, 10 feet from his lair. And the bear looks scared. With a flap and a flurry, all the friends gather near. They give him bear hugs and they calm his bear fears. Later in the night, all clustered in a heap, the bear spins stories while his friends fall asleep. Cuddled up tight, they snore through the night and the bear feels safe. The end. See, we'll all be okay together. Thanks so much for tuning in today. Stay tuned to Calvert Library's social media platforms for more storytime snippets. Thanks. Bye-bye.